This is Minecraft's most secure vault, equipped with 100 withers, 10,000 TNT minecarts, wardens, and at the very center, the dragon egg, the prized possession of the player who banned me from the server. After I was unbanned, I knew I needed revenge, so I gathered four of Minecraft's most elite players and tried to break in. Okay, here it is, here it is. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. This, Wait, this is crazy. crazy. I broke, I broke, I broke, I broke. Okay, I broke. Okay, here we are, here we are. Holy. Right, I'm bridging forward. Wait, Good everyone load up on water. There it is. Oh, here we go. Goodness, dude. Place water, oh, place water, place water. Oh my Everybody's god. Get borders, get borders. Get borders out. Oh my god. We're f that. We're f that. Or so we would be if I wasn't the one who designed the vault six months ago. Wait, no, we're actually dead. We're actually dead. It's here! It's here! It all began when the dragon egg was put on public display at spawn, begging to be stolen. The builders, however, predicted this, so they encased it in a glass shell. Get too close, and both the egg and the thief would explode. Can you guess how many TNT minecarts are there? My guess, like 120. <laughs> it was said to be impossible to break in, so of course, I was gonna try. See, on this server, whenever you kill someone, you steal one of their permanent hearts. And when you reach zero, you're banned. So when my friend Mapic came to me wanting to craft a revive beacon, a one-of-a-kind item that allows you to unban players, I decided to give him the seven hearts he needed in order to do so. In return, I... I got a chest plate. <laughs> Admittedly, not my smartest deal. But he was my friend, and I ended up cherishing the chest plate as like a symbol of our friendship, because it did have the rarest trim in the game on it. But anyway, the exchange left me on two hearts. So knowing I could sell the egg to regain my footing, the heist was literally a matter of life or death. But I wasn't the only one who wanted the egg. Pangy really wants the egg. Except Pangy only wanted it as a status symbol, a vain display of power. So with his right-hand man, Prince Sam, he too started trying to crack the vault. This was a race. I spent hours researching all of the vault's flaws in the creative world. Yo, wait. Holy sh... Until finally, I had done it. Break this top one, load up full blast prot, and we cross our fingers. And that's it, we have the egg. It was time to take what I'd learned to the real server. But as I was preparing, oh my God. There's no way. There's no way we don't get the egg tonight, right? Oh my god. Pangy and his associate are here, dude. Oh, is that Rochambeau? If he steals yeah. it, we just kill him, okay? Okay, there's parkour we have to do to get up here. So we have to do all this parkour. This is a parkour race, what? what? I'm doing it. He's so far up there. Oh my god. Shoot. Ouch. He fell, he fell, he fell. Okay. This is it. I'm so close. I'm so close. He, he might died. die. You <laughs> might, you might fall and die. <sighs> oh my god. Oh, we did it. Go, 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 go. I am so nervous, dude. He's mining. They're almost done with the parkour, dude. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, oh, oh. Dude. Guys, let me explain. Let me explain. No, Dude, Shambo, like... you don't understand. I bred over a thousand camels to get the egg. Became a billionaire by selling camels. I have so many people behind me because I have power. And you are powerless. You have one heart. You have no gear. And because of that, you have nobody behind you. And you're alone. Pengi's words echoed in my head the entire time I was banned. You have no idea because I have power. You're alone. You're alone. After a while, I started to miss hanging out with my friends. No matter what, though, I couldn't get over Pengi's words. So I began watching his streams. We're gonna get people in this jail cell. They have to pay me 10,000 coins for the bail. The richest people on the server, alright? You're not even a businessman. Who are you? There's a penny text on the server and people have not been paying it correctly. You are nothing to me, alright? Spencer, shut the f*** up. You don't know how to I make money. Spencer, you, you have no pay. idea how you can make money on this server. I know how I know. Bad. I have been studying this server for over a month. You have I know. no clue. I've learned there's more to the server than money. Chat, what's this guy yapping on? Chat, let's be- Oh, what's this guy yapping? I'm, I'm, oh, what's this guy yapping? 
This guy has no clue. Money is everything. He don't know what he's talking about, chat. Eventually, Mapik used the hearts I gave him to craft a revive beacon like he'd planned, but after reviving me, I didn't see much of him. After months of being banned, I just wanted to hang out with people, but because I only had four hearts, nobody wanted anything to do with me. Well, you are a you know, sad, sad, soggy little guy. Awesome. Look at him. Look uh -huh. at Roshan's Oh my lord. Bro, you actually need to just get logged hey. off, bro. Just log hey. off. Even Mapik had started working with Pangy. We drifted. What if we just full jump Brandon, Bacon? Can we? Can we? You're not allowed to join. There's Why? No because you're just going to get three tapped. Like, bro, you're not invited. What the f We're going to drop you if you try. As much as I hate Pangy and, like, as badly as I want revenge, like, Pangy was right. Like, I'm completely powerless. And because of that, like, I have nobody. And the worst part is, dude, like, there's no way out of it. Like, the only way to gain hearts is to either kill someone or, or trade for hearts. And with no possessions and no health, like, how am I going to do either of those? Like, literally all I have left is this chestplate Mavic gave me. God knows I'm not selling that. Pangy had stolen everything from me. But I was going to steal it back. Not long after I was revived, I had learned that the dragon egg I'd blown up was but a decoy. And the real one had fallen into the hands of Pangy. Ever since that day, it sat in his ender chest, impossible to steal and never to be seen. If I could somehow get my hands on it, sell it for hearts, and become powerful, then maybe my friends would come back. The plan was to construct Minecraft's most secure vault so that Pangy would feel comfortable placing the egg inside. Unbeknownst to Pangy, it would be at that point that I would break into my own vault and steal it for my own. Is Ro here or not? Uh, I'm coming, I'm coming up. No, maybe you're on this side, come here. Oh, sorry. Oh, really? <laughs> Yeah, he's the dragon egg, right? Right, Mavic? Right? Yeah, yeah. I'm on the council. Uh, okay. I feel I feel pretty guilty about blowing up the egg, and mm -hmm. I don't want anything to happen to it again. So, how would you feel if I constructed a massive, elaborate vault in order to store the egg? Okay. That's what do you think? What do, what do you think? If he shows you the vault and you can't break in, then you can give it to him. Hold on, hold on. How do we know we can trust you? Ooh. I'm a, that, I, don't, I don't even need to touch the dragon egg. All, you can place it in yourself for all I care. I just want... Well, point that. But what if we put it in the vault and then you just steal it and you just take it and put it in like another vault? He probably just wants to get in our good graces and also think about how impressive it will be. Let's just let him do it. Okay, sure. Yeah. All right, sounds good. Although I now had Pangy's permission, I knew it wouldn't be as simple as that. After all, he had just banned me off the server not too long ago. If I made even the smallest mistake, Pengi would instantly begin to suspect me and simply refuse to place the egg in the vault. The task before me then was to design a vault so secure that Pengi would feel safe placing the egg inside, yet also weak enough for me to break into. This was a battle of wits. I immediately got to work designing six different rooms to protect the egg in a creative world. If you hop in the boat, I'll send you off. The first was a wall of a hundred withers. When someone gets close, all a hundred of them will spawn in. And keep in mind, you're over the void right now. Oh. A hundred withers coming at you, either bridging or taking a flying machine. Uh-huh. Does not, does not bode well. I don't think so, no. My presentation to Pangy had to be flawless. If I made a single mistake or a machine malfunctioned, he would lose trust and simply refuse to place the egg inside. So how does this work? Pangy fired off question after question. Clearly suspicious. So the withers only spawn when the chunk reloads. Oh, uh, so we're gonna get out real quick. I kind of want to see that. <laughs> well, let's fly out. Here we go. Wait, so now we'll turn to it. Sometimes you have to go further. From from when I tested it, you have to go like decently far. Uh, yeah, it's not turned. Already, a machine had failed. I stumbled through room after room, countered question after question, until we found ourselves in the final chamber. Right now, the egg is suspended on sand above the void. If a player breaks or places any blocks, it'll instantly fall into the void. Oh shit, can I try it? Yeah, yeah, go for it. Another machine broken. Where, where did it go? I scrambled to fix it. I lost the egg, bro, Shambo. Hold up, hold up. It's because I don't have this one activated. Let me actually activate it. I began to panic, just trying to fill the silence. Put this here. Okay, it should be good now. But suddenly, the machine activated all on its own. 
Oh. Okay, well. <laughs> when you activate it, that, that's what will happen. Everything was a mess. I was scared to ask Pengi for permission to build the vault on the actual server. Even if he let me, there was no guarantee that he would actually place the egg inside. You can build it, but I want to see it before it's done. So it better be working by then. Although I was on thin ice, we were in business. It was time to start gathering the Herculean amount of materials that I would need, beginning with an obsidian farm. Notoriously one of the most dangerous farms to build because at its core was a wither. Okay, this is it, this is it. I'm so nervous, bro. <laughs> Actually so nervous. <sighs> Here goes nothing. Please, please, please. Please. It's killing me! Oh my gosh. Although the wither was trapped in place, the farm still wasn't working. I ran to the overworld to grab supplies to fix it, but when I came back, the wither was nowhere to be seen. It was still out there, but unable to find it, I eventually gave up, built a new wither, and finished gathering the materials. It was time to start building. I think it's just hitting me how dangerous this is. I am literal blocks above the void. If my finger happens to slip off the shift button, or if I, like, look at an enderman the wrong way, I'm instantly dead. But soon, the feeling of danger gave way to something else. This is so, like, lonely. Like, <laughs> I'm honestly starting to burn out already. If someone else was here, I'd be fine, but alone, like... This is torture. I tried joining a voice call, but everyone was in a fight. And it, it was just a reminder that everyone else was having fun and I was sad here. <sighs> well, at least the room's done. I simply couldn't sit cooped up alone in the end anymore. And in order to build the next chamber, I would need an insane amount of strength. I knew a player named Parrot had a farm for it, and he'd offered to let me use it if I helped him kill one of his enemies. So the next day, when Parrot messaged me it was time, I made my way over to the battlefield. I think we should- I think we should ambush from behind, what do we think? I quickly noticed that someone was shooting slow-falling arrows, the last ones on the server ever since phantoms had been disabled. I knew that I might see some value from them, so I ventured into the battle to retrieve some. Still, on such low health, one hit would kill me. I'm right behind them, dude. <laughs> I'm right under what? them. What? Oh, yeah, I'm with them. I'm in this, but they don't see me, but... Where? Where? Spectacles oh, yeah. here! Oh, they're here, they're here, they're here. No they're way! Here. Nice smoke, nice smoke. Nice, nice. nice. We got this. Is this one? Oh my god. I don't know who's who. No, 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 no! Oh, okay, okay, it's fine, it's fine. Oh my god. Guys, we're all on gold. This gold guy is dead, no matter what. Oh. Nice! Oh, yeah. Yeah. Let's go! Nice. Let's go, baby! Good Actually, let's yeah. go! But then... I was dead. Just like that. A grim reminder of just how weak I was. But more importantly, why I was alone. Although I was finally able to gather the string I needed, as well as craft a few hearts so that I wouldn't be on two, I was still losing hearts at the same rate I could craft them. Although I wanted badly to quit, the only way I was going to get anywhere sizable was by continuing the project and stealing the egg. Disappointed, I returned to building what once was a vault, but now seemed to be a prison. And as if to rub salt in the wound, I received a message from Pangi rushing me to build, even adding that everything had better be working. He was clearly still suspicious, and the idea that Pangi might not even place the egg inside just discouraged me even more. Rage was the only thing that propelled me through the building of another chamber. At which point, I needed to get a warden in the end. See, chamber 5 was to be an obsidian maze with no exit. Beneath would lie a warden, ready to blast anyone who came near. So after digging a long tunnel from ancient city to end portal, I activated the shriekers and made my attempt. Here it is, here it is. Okay, got it. Otherwise it's not gonna follow me. Come on, come on. Oh, it's on me. Can I make it past there? Oh my... What? This is impossible on four hearts. I needed help. But who would be willing to help me? I had no possessions to compensate anyone for aid, but if I wanted to complete the project, there was no other way. 
I decided to call up another server member and offer what little I could. What's Yo, up, brother? Hello. So what is this, uh, what is this? So basically, <laughs> I need your help getting a warden into the end. Okay. I need you to lead it from the ancient city to the end portal. I'm down. Sounds fun. Actually, I can compensate you in a few days. Nah, don't worry about it. But if either of us died here, Brandon would almost certainly be unwilling to try again. And what's more, I'd be so low on hearts that completing the rest of the project would be near impossible. We had one shot to do this. All the way down that tunnel, there's a there's an ancient city. And you want me to bring a warden to it. <laughs> just bring a warden. You just have to get it through the portal, and then I'll take it from there to the vault. Wait, hey, take this name tag. Take this name tag. You have to name it this. Oh, you have to. I have to name tag this thing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Bro, you're actually f brand. Okay, so you're calling. You're actually not calling. I have 20 hearts, bro, and I still think I'm like a two tap. Actually? Yeah. Okay, I'm just get this thing over with. It should be spawning. It's behind oh, you. I got it. I got name tag. Got name tag. Got name tag. Go 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 go. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh yeah, this thing's mad at me. Oh no, God. Oh shit. Oh, shit. oh my God. Oh my goodness. Oh my God. Speed go 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 go. Speed fat. Oh, it started its range attack. Okay, that, oh was, my God. Uh, that was a lot of damage Yo, dude. That just took out a quarter of my health in one hit. Okay. <laughs> oh, shoot. I need glass. Oh, shoot. Yeah. It's like stuck in the cave. <laughs> in the, in the like, dripstone cave? Yeah, I'm like trying to mine at it before it kills me. It just keeps, it just keeps like ranging me. Yeah. Oh, okay. I think I got it free. Oh, oh my God. I have to free from another stuck thing, bro. Oh, 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 it is close to me. Oh, it is close to me oh now. My God. Um, I oh, see yeah. you. Start running, start running, start running, start running. Bro. Oh start my running. God. I'm jumping in the portal. Tell me, tell me when you put it through. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, here Do we it. go. Okay, it's it's really close. It's really close, really close, really close. Coming through in three. Hey, it went around the portal. What? It's loose in the, it's loose in the room. It's loose in the dude, room. What? You have to get it through, get it through somehow, dude. It's a bad situation here. Dude, there's a wither in here. What? Oh my god, it's from the farm. I'm gonna have to eat my god apple. This is so bad. Oh my god. Wait, can I just send it through right now? Can I just send it through? It's almost dead. It's almost dead. Not yet, not yet, not yet. Oof. It's about to come oh. through. Be ready, be ready. I'm not ready. I'm sorting back. It's coming through, it's coming through. Just give me one more second. Just give me one more second. It's through, it's through, it's through, it's through. It's through, it's through, it's through. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. It's gonna- it's angry. No, come on the bridge, come on the bridge. <gasps> I hit it. Oh, it's on me! Oh god, dude, please. Oh my god. It's so close, it's gonna be so close to me, dude. There it is. It can't fit. Oh, I can, I can. Uh, come on, come on, come on. Uh, are you I'm sure? Dead. Are you sure you did the right thing? Please lock oh it in, god. lock it in, lock it in, lock it in. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm, I'll go, go, lock go, it go, in. go, 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 go. <laughs> oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Please, please, please be in there, please be in there. Locked, 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 I locked, I locked, it's in, I locked, it's in, it's in, it's in, it's in, it's in. Let's go, let's okay. go. Oh. Dude, that, it almost got out last second, bro. Oh my god. The warden in place, I began work on chamber four, a room that would require a password in the form of a named block sent by Pangi himself. A password not even I would know. Failure to enter the password would result in the explosion of the room and would drop the player into the void below. As I built, I was fulfilled. Although I'd just died and it'd be extremely risky to simply continue building as just three deaths would result in a ban, thoughts of the very real danger I was in were replaced by the feeling of connection, of finally sharing some laughs for the first time since I'd been unbanned and I craved more. After finishing my third room, I found myself at spawn where people were congregating. Eat his butt, eat his butt. Guys, don't attack the monster. Eat his butt, eat his butt, eat his butt. It was honestly just really nice. No conflicts, no avarice, just human connection. There's a fart smeller behind you. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Even Mapic and Zam, Pengy's closest associates, were joining in the fun. One, two, three. Yeah, yeah baby! Yeah. Woo! That was all, that was good, everybody. That was good. That was cool. That was great. That was honestly so nice. I know this isn't true, but... It at least feels like I connected with maybe and Sam on, on some level. It feels really weird to say, because there's no, like, way for that to happen. But, I don't know. That was nice. A feeling of, this time, warmth propelled me through the building of Chamber 4, which was to be a series of walls that, once broken, would instantly repair themselves. But eventually, my complacency caught up to me. 
Dude. That just burned everything. I'm dead! I'm, it's over. No, I'm actually... I don't know what I can... What do I do? Just one death away from being banned again, and unable to get the materials to craft hearts. If I was to try to do anything, let alone continue the project, I needed hearts. The first person who offered me help was Mapic. I offered to trade the only thing I could. Do you think I'd be able to give you the last slow falling arrows on the server in exchange for a heart? Yep, yep, yep. Still, two hearts was nowhere near enough, and the trades I'd have to make grew more and more detrimental. Perhaps most importantly though, the server had figured out how important my chest plate was to me. So, Pangy sent one of his underlings to go fetch it for his collection. That chest plate you're wearing right now, you're gonna drop it to me, and I'll give you I'll give you your heart. Does that work? There's nothing else you want, dude. There's nothing else. Literally nothing else. Just that chest plate. Like, I can't like I'll give you like two hearts in a month for one for, No 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 no. You are giving me that chest plate for any type of heart. That's it. Like, I'm taking nothing else. I don't care about anything else. Fuck. I don't need the chest play right now, but like, you you kind of need these hearts, I won't even lie. It would be in your best interest just to drop the chest play and get this over with. Give him the seven hearts. Give him the Yeah, yeah. All right. Thank you, Rochambeau. The pleasure has been mine. Oh, jeez, this is clean as hell. We clean out here. Okay, okay. The only way I was able to complete Chamber 2 was through my calls with Mavic. Dude, I don't know if... Fuck, bro. Is your mic gonna sound like this in the recording? <laughs> yes. The chamber was to be an impassable minefield. Anyone detected would be blown up and dropped into the void below. I just like, I can't participate in anything because I have no hearts, I have no power, like I have nothing. You can do things outside of PvP, dog. Maybe, I don't know. I just feel like, friends-wise, people are often just attracted to power. Like we read this quote today in Latin class. It's, I think it's by Ovid. It said, if you are wealthy, you will have many friends. People do not care how strong you are. I don't know, man. Maybe you're right. Finishing the chamber was torture. With the ridiculous amount of netherrack required, on top of my poor mental state, I began to fall apart. Zam would occasionally join the server and say hi, or we'd exchange a few words, and aside from that and maybe in my talks, the work was grueling. I began to seclude myself, devoted only to finishing the build. I became oblivious to the happenings outside the prison that I had sentenced myself to. Pangi began acting at the expense of his allies. He and Zam had agreed to match skins, so when he discarded the skin in order to perform a business deal, Zam? tension stirred. You suck. What the f I'm just being honest. Why are you a police officer? I thought we were pirates. I mean... You took, off your, you took off your pirate skin yesterday. That really hurt my feelings. I'm, I'm, uh, that was... No, no, okay, let me explain, let me explain. I know, but let me explain. You didn't even get them to kill me. Prism, let me explain, let me explain. Listen to me, listen to me, all right? I am- Dude, you didn't even think about it. All you care about is growing your wealth, and it shows. Okay, let me explain. While all this was going on, I managed to finish the vault. I messaged Pangy that the vault was complete, and then nothing. A day passed. Two. Had he lost trust in me? Was he still willing to place the egg inside? As my worries grew, I sent another message, desperate for some kind of response. In the meantime, however, I began planning how I would break in. Alright, we're trying to see if it's possible to break into even just the first chamber. I've been so focused on just trying to get it past Pangi that I haven't actually taken into account whether or not it's possible. <laughs> we'll start responding like 
ten withers. So like one tenth of what we actually have. Oh my gosh, I hear them. Wait, I just blocked the water. Holy sh! Oh my gosh, dude. Oh. This is impossible. <laughs> how am I gonna do this? But before I had time to figure out how to survive even just the first chamber, Pengi messaged me. He claims that he had placed the egg inside, but did he really trust me? I kind of doubted that Pengi had actually done it, but with all the machines primed, there was no way to check. It was time to break in. Still, it would be impossible alone. I needed a team. The first person I asked was Minute, the same player who had helped me with the warden. I'm down. Sounds fun. Still, I knew that just the two of us wouldn't cut it, but the only other players I was even close with were Mapic and Zam, both allies to Pangi. I knew that it was risky to bring them in on the plan, but if I wanted this heist to be successful, I needed them. So now I need your help steal, like breaking back in and stealing back that. Bro, I DM'd Pengi yesterday, and he didn't answer that. Who does that, bro? I hate him. Ever since he got the egg, bro's been ghosting me. I think he should... Mm, never mind. He thinks just because he's rich, everyone has to be loyal to him. It's so annoying. So, is that a yes? Ooh, yeah. Yeah, let's do it. I'd rather support someone I genuinely enjoy over someone who just sees everyone as an asset. So with the team assembled, we all began gearing up. But we had to be quick. Pengi had made it a habit to log on every couple hours to check on everything he oversaw. If we picked up the egg and got the achievement while he was online, it was game over. More importantly though, if we died, our time would run out. So with just over an hour to pull off the heist, we headed to the end. Wait, okay, before we leave, before we leave, when we, when we get there, there's gonna be a wall of a hundred withers. There'll be three that actually like target on us. And um, so we have to kill those three. When we get like, within like a 40 block radius, like get out of the flying machine and start making like a platform so we don't get like blown off. Like, so. Oh, how do we pull? All right, I'm going ahead. Okay, oh, okay. Oh, okay. I'm, in, I'm, in, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. I, I literally almost died. I literally oh, you actually did. Should I stop? Not yet, once we get a little closer. Okay, here it is, here it is. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. This Wait, this is, is crazy. crazy. I broke, I broke, I broke, I broke. Okay, I broke, broke, Okay, here we are, here we are. Holy. All right, I'm bridging forward. Wait, everyone shaking. load up on water. There it is. Oh Here we go. Goodness, dude. Oh water, my goodness. Water, goodness. Water. Oh my god. Oh my god. Get borders, get borders. Get borders down. Get borders down. Oh my god. We're f***ing dead. We're f***ing dead. Wait, gap up, gap up. Oh my god, they're shooting, they're shooting, they're shooting, they're shooting. Wait, no, we're actually dead. No, we're actually dead. It's the air, it's the air. This is really bad. It's almost it's half health. It's half health. No, we when they go in melee, what do we lose. When they go in melee, what do they break the obby and we lose. Oh shoot! Yeah, yeah, no, yeah, water, just keep water. water, keep water, keep water. Fight them in water. You're chilling. You're chilling. We're chilling. Once, once, one's, one's in melee. One's in melee mode. One's in melee. Two, two, two are in melee. Oh my god! Get it, get it, get it. Great. We're off. We're off. No, we're not. This is it. This is it. This is easy. Watch out! Watch out! Nice. Oh my god! One melee mode. It's breaking the obby. Whoa, oh, Zim! Minute careful, minute careful! Oh my goodness, bro. Okay, this is easy. This oh should my be god, I went flying! Got it. Dead, 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 dead. We gotta go before the rest get on us. Let's go, let's go. Wonder, wait, wait, what's the game plan here? Just follow me, follow me. This is the next room. In here is, um, it's, it's a mine okay. field, basically, with skulk. So don't, don't mine straight, don't mine straight. We have to go to the top left corner to avoid it. What do you like, mean by mine field? Yeah, we're like, tens of thousands of carts. Like what? It's like why do you do this to us? Like, dude, I've memorized the correct path. I've memorized the correct path. There's no okay. way. There's actually no way. Okay, everyone follow behind me. Oh. You go forward. Oh. Thirty-one. <laughs> One, two. No, don't, dude. You can't. <laughs> <laughs> Just follow behind me. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. What? Is it skull activated? One, two, yeah, three, four, five, six, seven. Wait, dude, I miscounted. God. One, two, three. Four, five, you six, can't even seven, count to five, eight, bro. Like, nine, 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 <laughs> 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Sam, go. Wait, how many is that? 15, 16, oh, 17, oh, 18. Wait, this is it. This is it. Okay, we mine down from here. You go ahead. You go ahead. I can hear the cards. 13, 14, 15. Okay, we're down, and then we go forward seven. Oh, one, 
four, five, six, seven. Oh, oh my god! Oh, oh. Yo, that's Dude, my I was on half a. Oh. Zam, where Sam. are you, bro? What, what? are you doing up there? Sam. Dude! <laughs> Sam, Sam, you almost just killed all of us. Oh my god! Come down from there, bro. Like Hey guys, I disarmed it. There's still two more below us. Dude, you're about to die, dude. Oh, okay. Don't just up and keep mining. Holy dude, shit. It's gonna blow up. Here's what you do, okay? Stand back. That's tens Ooh, of we thousands. Should, yeah, we bro. should like gamble it. We should just start mining at random. <laughs> it's gonna blow up. That, we will be over here, man. Don't worry. <laughs> you have you have fun figuring this out. You're the one with the paper. Okay, I think this is it. Wait, wait, wait. This is it. This is it. I got it. I got it. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. okay. I'll, I'll trust you. These last two blocks are. They will set it off. But through what? the. No, but through it, through it is a path. So we just have to break them really fast and then just run through. Okay. Oh, oh, oh is that, that all we have to do? Yeah. I'm gonna triple gap. <laughs> sounds simple enough. Yeah, so we just. Push my leg and right. Wait, wait, who's making this with the bottom one? Okay, I'll do I, the top. Ready? I'm I got bottom. Ready? Three, two, Three, two, two one, one, go. Sorry. We're here now. <laughs> These are like regenerating walls. All right, guys, okay. I know exactly what to do. I Wait, I here. Let me try first. Let me try. Let me take my first whack. Dude, make it. Make it. You're gonna get pushed. You're gonna get pushed. No, oh, oh, oh my god. Maybe oh, get, get out of that. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Okay, so okay, that's why are you getting that obvious? It won't. It won't. Replace. Yeah, that's what I did. That's what I did. That's what I did. Go oh, hard. Like Go it. like that. Go like that. Go like that. Yeah, yeah, we're good now. Oh my gosh. This is a this is a more chill room. Oh, we're good. Didn't even matter. Oh yeah, this is it, this is it, we're through. This one is, uh, there's a password in the form of a block that we have to enter to get to the next room. There is TNT below, but don't worry, we have the right password, so. See, when I recruited Sam, I knew we needed him not only because of his skill, but also because of his proximity to Panky. I need you to find the password block. Before long, he came back to me with Andesite. But still, with thousands of TNT ready to blow us all into the void, if he wanted to betray, now was the perfect chance, and part of me still questioned why he wanted to join us when Peggy was clearly so much more powerful. Still, with just 15 minutes until Peggy was to log on, I would just have to hope that my time spent with Zam was enough for him to consider me a friend. Okay, okay. let's go. Okay, the next room is the warden. I think we try sending one person through. Be careful, because yo, it's I'm just thinking. There's only one player with 20 hearts. Yeah, here right I, I was about to say I have the most hearts here. I, I okay. can go through the warden room. It's on an enderman. It's okay, distracted. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. But make sure you have okay. a way back. Make sure you have a way back. I'm loud. I'm loud. I'm loud. Mapic, you dumbass. Mapic, it's gonna shoot you, bro. It's on me. It's on me. It's on me. It just, it just blasts uh, me. Okay, come back. Come back. Just, just come back. Good though. No, just come back. Just come back. Just come back. Rochambeau I'm game. Good. I'm good, and we we're gonna get this dragon egg. No, <laughs> you're not, dude. Come back. It, it's killing me. It's killing me. I gotta come back. Actually, come back, bro. Actually, come back. Oh, okay, you want to come back? I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm, I'm unshifted. Look, at, look for my name tag. Look for my name tag. Okay, I'll, I'll try to find that. Okay, I'm, I'm trying to get back to you. I'm trying to get back to you. Can uh, someone get me? I don't, I don't, I don't know how to get over there. I, mean, I have tech. darkness. I can't see really well. Minute, I see you. I see you. Uh, am I back? This is so unbelievably dangerous. No, I'm here with them. He's here, he's here, he's here. Oh, actually, Zam, come oh. back, come back. Mini, even if you make it through, there's no way I make it through on four hearts. If it shoots me literally once, I'm dead. Like, hear me out. We take the warden, like, out of its, out of its, like, home in the bottom, and we run it over the TNT room behind us. What? That sounds And, and kill it. That sounds like that an sounds... easy way to fucking die. If you know hey. how to do it really well, yeah, we can do that. Someone's gonna get the warden on them, like, out of the room. Get it chasing them. Maybe don't turn around. <laughs> Do not turn around. You drop around. it incorrect. You have to be in there. I found him. Say the warden's on me. It's chasing me. I go here. I drop any block other than Andesite here. I keep running. The TNT blows up and then it falls into the void. Uh, like... He's gonna get out. Wait, he's he's coming up. He's coming Dude, up. Dude, I just have to run back over here. Get in yeah, position. Essentially. Get in position. Get in position. Get Dude, in position. I'm not okay. I'm not in position. Guys? I'm not in position. I'm not no. in position. <laughs> <laughs> no, oh shit! It's oh, coming wait. to me. It's coming to me. It's coming to me. No, drop no, 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 
Don't get ready to drop the, the wrong block on it. Okay, okay I got it, I got it. Make sure, you, it. You, don't, make sure you don't get blown up too. Make sure you don't get blown up too. Yeah. Okay, I'm ready, I'm ready. Okay, 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 here we go, 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 here we go. Run, 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 run. run. It's gonna blow up, it's gonna blow up. Go, 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 go. It's, in, it's, in, it's in the place, in the place. Blew it up. Minute. There it is, there it is. It did not die, it did it's not die. die. Just go to the other side, just go to the Where other side. Just bridge oh back God. over, kill bridge it, back kill over. It, kill it, it's on me, it's on, it's aggro me, kill it. Am I the only one here? Dude, I can't, last time it one taps me. Someone bridge to me, someone bridge to me, someone bridge to me. We're coming, we're coming, we're coming, we're coming, we're coming, we're coming. Just live, just live, just live. I'm lit, I'm, I'm fine, just kill it. If it hits me Bro, once, just... I'm dead. If it hits me once, I'm actually dead. It won't, it won't, it won't. It's aggro me, it's aggro me. Dude, please die, please die. Please, it's turning towards me. Oh my god, it's dead. Nice, okay. Let's go. Holy guys. I also oh. contributed. <laughs> I got the last hit. Oh my god. That's the worst way to do Brad, that. Dude, that was actually, the most, well, was actually the worst possible way. Okay, yeah. this is the last room. The egg is going to be sitting on sand, like over the void. Okay. If you break or place any blocks, it's it, it will just fall into the void. Okay, okay, okay so okay. do you see it in there? Do you see it in there? We have to go. Yeah, yeah, what? yeah I see it. So we go, we, we're going to go from under it and just bridge under. It's going to fall, but we just like hope that it, hope that it lands. Catch it? Yeah. Catch, what? Catch it with our bridge. Wait. Wait. Oh, uh, jeez, Rochambeau. This sounds like an awful idea. This sounds insane. Because it is, partially. There's got to be a way to get over there the without location. bridging. There's got to be a creative way to get over there without bridging. We racked our brains, trying to think of something, anything we could use to collect the egg safely. I thought back through everything I'd done, every step I'd taken, until... Hey, do you still have the slow falling arrows I gave you? Yeah. No, no, no. Yeah. No, no, no. You fall, you fall down to the bottom, and you just, and you just, you just, you just break, you just like place blocks. All right, sh shoot me okay. a minute. Okay. It's okay. under the red sand. It's under the red sand. Place blocks all between the nether axe, though. Let's go. Let's go. Surely this works. Here we go, maybe. Come on. Die. Bring it home. Oh my god! Nice play, nice. Got it! Nice. Let's go! Nice. Oh my god! Okay, okay. Uh, how do I get this? Oh my god! Oh my god. Wait, we can all bridge in now. Bridge in. Everyone bridge in. Yeah! Let's go! Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Oh my god! Holy. All right, fellas, come back up. Thanksgiving is officially saved. Let's, Let's get, get out of here. Let's we get out of here. here. Let's get the f out of here. <laughs> Holy, bro, we did it. But there was still one last heist to pull off. Okay, so Maypick messaged me the other day with cords to something. He said it was like a gift. Managed to get it for you. No shot. <laughs> Yo. Yo. What's up? What did you want to show me? So, I have some I have some news for you. Do you remember when you banned me up here? I I I do remember that. Yeah. When you did that, you took everything from me. And when I was revived, I had nothing. I had no hearts, no power, no allies. And you were right, to be honest. I have no power. I still have no power. But Contrary to what you might believe to be possible in a situation like that, I have still found people who have my back. Anyway, all this is to say that the dragon egg has been stolen and I'm the thief. You're the thief. Oh, it gets better. Do you want to know who helped me? Minute, Mapic, and your closest ally, Zam. Mapic and Zam betrayed you in a heartbeat. What does. And not even because they wanted power. But just because we're genuine friends, and we all thought it'd be fun. In any case, the egg means nothing to me. So, if you want the egg back, you're gonna give me five hearts. Fuck you, Rochambeau. Can I see the dragon egg in your hand? Oh, yeah, Just yeah. trying to make sure I'm not getting scammed. Okay. Here you go. Thank you, Pangy. You just got robbed again.
Ovid wrote that as long as you're wealthy, you will have many friends. And for a while, I believed that. But I didn't realize that there was a second piece to the quote. As long as you're wealthy, you will have many friends. But if your days become cloudy, you'll be alone. Although I may not have been wealthy, I wasn't alone. Also, please don't send hate to anyone in this video. Although this video is unscripted, some of the events were dramatized, but they are genuinely good people. And obviously, it's Minecraft. <laughs> anyway, the algorithm thinks you'll like one of these videos more than most, so click on it if you want more.